nine-year-old girl fatally shot by a neighbor in front of her father after buying ice cream and riding her scooter, prosecutors allegedly says. August 9th, 2023. Such a tragedy. Okay, CNN. A nine-year-old girl was fatally shot in front of her Chicago home by a neighbor who allegedly fired the gun at her before father her father ran towards the shooter and tackled him to the ground according to the legal document cnn obtained tuesday michael goodman 43 is charged with first degree murder and the killing of a child who rode her scooter to buy ice cream from a nearby ice cream truck before shooting set before the shooting saturday evening According to the document, the shooting comes at the U.S. as the U.S. continues to grapple with widespread gun violence, which is the leading cause of death in children hmm. and teenagers in the country. Firearms accounted for nearly 19% of childhood deaths between the ages of 1 and 18. 2021, according to the Centers of Disease Control and Prevention Wonders database, nearly 3,600 children died in gun-related incidences. Okay, incidents that year. Before Saturday shooting, the girl's father was talking to friends who were in a vehicle in front of his Portage Park residence, while his daughter, identified as B, was riding her scooter according to the document known as a bond profer okay, which I have no idea what that means okay. the father heard a gunshot and told his daughter to take her scooter okay what, what? the father heard a gunshot and told his daughter to take her scooter back to the apartment probably this is not related as V approached the front door of her apartment building, D shooter emerged from his apartment building across the street holding a firearm, the document states. The father and other witnesses saw the neighbor, identified as Michael Goodman, across the street as he approached the child, and the father shouted at the neighbor what, what, he, what he was doing according to the document. While V's father ran to his daughter, he observed D raise the firearm, point at his at, at the V, and shoot V in the head. Wow. V's father tackled D in the vestibule. Okay. And as they both fell to the ground, the gun discharged, striking D in the eye. Wow. The document said. The child was taken in the hospital when she was pronounced dead. The suspect was arrested and taken to the hospital. Police swabbed the suspect's hand while he was in the hospital as they tested positive for gun gunshot residue. The document said a 9mm Koenig firearm was re recovered outside the apartment. Goodman is being held without bail at authorities' request. That the defendant is responsible for the death of a person and the defendant was armed with a firearm and that he personally discharged the firearm and it approximately caused the death to another individual the document states there's more information here okay but what i want to say about this this is a tragic event this, is, this should never happen but um as i'm a person who's um a paranoid uh, schizo myself okay i am basically a person who will not allow my daughters to be out of my sight in any kind of situation okay they have to be monitored and there must be cameras this is why i tell parents all the time always go to the park with your teenage kids you do not let them out of your sight this is a terrible thing i don't know what i would do in a situation like this all right okay it is very important 
to protect your daughters and your children, not just your daughters, but your sons and your daughters, okay, you know, from domestic violence that may occur at any time. It is better to overall be antisocial than to be so friendly with the neighbors, okay, you know, because this guy came out of nowhere. Probably be the shot he heard before he saw the guy come out of the house. Gave him an alert, an alert in his head, you know, because if I hear any shootings where I live at, I'm automatically getting the hell out of the neighborhood. It's not going to, I'm not even going to debate that, okay, because I lived in the hood. But other than that, it's a terrible fate for the little girl, okay, and her father. It's just terrible, man. I think about my two daughters all of the time. And sometimes I wish I was back in Ethiopia, which I didn't hear no gunshots at all, okay. But um, other than that, you guys are going to have to protect your daughters and your sons from domestic violence. You're going to have to start homeschooling and cyber schooling, guys. Okay, this is very important. Holistic over um, a shot in the dark. All right. But of course, y'all have a nice day. This is just some terrible information I saw. Um, and you take it easy. Take my advice. Heed my advice if you're wise. Okay. Okay. Antisocial behavior is, a, is, is, is actually part of the intellectual race of people. You know, you don't socialize with ordinary people that are not um, a part of your cup of tea. Okay, right? You don't want to waste your time doing that. Other than that, y'all have a nice day and be, be paranoid, my friends. Peace.